up, bitches? Hi, guys. Welcome back to part two of my Motherland, Fort Salem, season one, episode four reaction video. If you haven't checked out part one of this reaction, go and click the link in the description box below to watch that one first. Otherwise, let's just get right back into this episode. Rael is confronting Scylla because she knows something's wrong. She knows in her soul. And I am stressed, as as usual. Um, So, without further ado, let's just get right back into this episode. Let's go. So I'm, I'm having these these visions, and they're his visions, they're his memories. Yes. I saw you in them. You yes. Were so I need you to explain what's happening because I cannot make sense of this. Did G you see him that night? Yes. I, I'm I'm just I'm confused. It's not adding up. Do you care about me? Yes. yes. Wow. Listen, I need you to trust me. Stop asking these questions. Don't go down this road. What do you mean? I'm sorry. I have to go. So. I See, that's weird. That's weird, right? Like, come on, she's, it's like, it's kind of like, you know what I'm sensing now? It's kind of like, Scylla knows that Rael's on this path to finding out the truth, right? But she's like, don't go down this path. Like, she's kind of worried for her. Like, don't go down this path. It's like, she's actually scared of Rael finding out the truth. Not about her, but like, what, but what, because oh, she's part of the spirit, right? So what if she go, if she finds all this stuff out, what if the spirit goes after her or go, you know, goes after Rael? Maybe like, Scylla's like really... Con it's becoming concerned, like, she, I saw, I sense of, uh, uh, I sense a bit of, like, worry, like, for real, like, you know, in still, she was like, I'm worried about, like, don't go down this path, please, there was, like, a warning, I think, maybe, we'll find out. Thank you. Let's all support my daughter in this time. Oh my god, where's Gary? He's gonna come through, right? Oh my god, this is actually a really cool dance. I love this. He's looking at her! He's looking at her, that's right! Appreciate my- Appreciate her for who she is, that's right. Oh my god, that's so cool. Yes, bitch! Yes! Y'all see that shit? Y'all see that? Y'all see my OTP, bitch? What? Yes. I'm content at the moment. Also, Abigail, go the fuck off with two men living for that. Oh, yes, bitch. Give me that. I deserve that, to be honest. I actually deserved that. Oh my god, who just- Oh my god. Yes, my Craven would write, bitch! I don't need the real to tell me how I feel. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm dead. I know that rhymes. <laughs> my rights! My Craven would! Is it Craven would? That's the thing, Craven would. My fucking- I broke the fan, but I don't give a crap. I'm gonna use it anyways. Go the fuck off, Cravenwood! Oh! And Abigail! Oh, we're getting dick tonight, ladies. Sorry. <laughs> oh my god. Love a threesome. Is that older and the Witcher guy? I can go off, sis. Love that. <laughs> Everyone's getting sex apparently from me this week. Let's, let's be honest. They aren't fine. No worries. I want my own Beltane. Can we do that? <laughs> oh! Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> yes, my gay rights. My rights existing this week! Oh. Also, can I just point out, and this is irrelevant, but Garrett has a really nice butt, sorry. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> this is the sex episode. This is the sex episode. You're having sex. Okay, same. How to which sex and romance guy? Stop. <laughs> don't, don't tell her, but I bet he sent her a picture of his. Yeah. <laughs> he did. It's a generic drawing from the book, by the way. Uh, for the record, this is why I'm in the curls. <laughs> <laughs> You'll decide to replenish the troops. I'd be happy to do it with you. 
Have you ever been in love? Oh, at least once a week. <laughs> beach, serious. beach, beach. Watch tonight. What would you do if you were so in love with someone <laughs> and maybe they'd done something wrong? Oh, the <laughs> dragon! If you ever in love with someone, <laughs> she loves her. <laughs> She loves it. Fuck off with this bullshit. You're real. Silla fucking come back. Come through, bitch. Your girlfriend loves you. I need this now. Get fucked, everybody. <laughs> oh, honey. Okay. But honestly, I guess you'd have to decide if that person was worth it. I think Silla's. Yeah, I think Silla's worth it. That's all you can do. And fight for her. I feel this. Uh -huh. I'm about to get downright copyrighted for that we can demonetize for oh my god I'm about to get demonetized. I'm sorry, but the window is closing. Oh yeah, what the f oh yeah. Don't look at don't Oh bitch, y'all wanna show me the fucking balloon one more time? I'm a popper myself. So what's her name? What's her name? Bellwether, her mom saw she did that cover. What happened? She did it and like did the thing. I saw it, right? And then she tried it again and nothing happened. But the balloon's fucking watching her. Bitch. Who was the last person you saw? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Did your death have anything to do with the screen? No. Oh my god, that's Why a... did you do it? Shit. Oh. Oh! T! Oh my god. So did he just accuse the witch father of casting the spell on him? Bitch. Is that. I understood that correctly. I really love their friendship. It's really grown on me the last episode. Oh my god, stop it. Don't. I don't say shit. <laughs> I did see Porter that night. Oh my god. You wanted to get back yeah. together and I didn't. I like you, okay? <laughs> I know. I have feelings for you. <laughs> and they're not something I'm used to having. I'm a Dodger, which means no attachments because things go away. Oh, look at that. We go away. <laughs> I have to learn. I don't know if I'm ever. <laughs> Oh my god, they're so in love! They're so in love! But we know that Rayelle's in love, completely in love. And like, Scylla's like getting there. She's like, I have feelings. Like, she's feeling. And she's and she said she never felt like that before. Like, you know. Oh, you're really gonna ruin my life! It's fine. I'm gonna lose it this year. I'm gonna figure it out to me. Okay? Oh my god! <laughs> Whoever you are. Whoever you are. Oh. Oh, buddy, she's in the spring. I don't know what happens. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, fuck off. Oh. oh my god, you got it really. One minute, they're like, you know, Scylla's really shady, like, you know, she's doing shit. Next minute, they're like, I'm in love. They have this cute ass scene together. Like, the flair. Oh my fuck off with your chemistry. I hate you all. <laughs> I'm in pain. This is what happens when your heart's like torn. Like one half's like, mm, and one half's like, yes, bitch. <sighs> I'm fine. <laughs> is this the goddess? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I love him. Oh. He's great. What's this? It's 
is the scourge for the name. It's clear no other wits deserves it more than you. No oh, bless. I can't think of any other way that would best honor his memory. Oh my god. That's really sweet actually. Ladies, you have ten minutes to get to the rough room for training. Oh, can you come back? I miss him already. Actually make that five. Let's go. Oh, they're so fucking precious. They're so precious. Where's Abigail? The homunculus has returned. Here to practice last. Is this bitch still going on? The stink would suit you. Do us all a favor and take up as a mannequin. Oh, these two are gonna have it out sometime. They're gonna have to go head to head in combat. I'm telling you. Sure, you know how to use that. Damn queen! That's amazing. Oh. Are you at training? This is a pleasant surprise. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh! Oh, we're doing sex again. Let's go, bitch it. Oh, fuck, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, who is she's not actually Rayal? I was gonna say she's in training. Bitch, who is it? Who is? I'm stressed. Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? You're supposed to be luring her to us. What? Up to you. You already made one mistake. We had to clean up. We won't put up with it. Wait, what? Porter, who do you think clean that up? The wedding, the bellwethers are thrown. Oh. Get yourself invited. What? It's not. Don't mess this one up. What the fuck? Nah, you don't touch Scylla like that. Who are you, bitch? Okay, that just changed the game for me. That, this bitch, obviously is part of the spree because that's, that's what they do. They fire their face off. <laughs> she clearly was like threatening, like full, like choking her, like abusing her. Like... I feel sorry for Scylla a little bit. Like, she doesn't deserve that. The fuck? You put your hands on her again, you bitch. Who are you, dumbass spree bitch? Sorry, I'm getting very angry. But, like, clearly this shows me that obviously, well, I don't know if it's obviously, but, like, maybe Scylla's, obviously, I know she's doing for the spree, but, like, she's taking orders from this lady or, like, Something's there's more to I told you there's more to her story. So she is an act I don't think she's actually evil. I just think she's maybe she's like forced. Because clearly she's like terrified of this of the spree and they're making her do stuff. Like that's why when Rael was like, you know, oh what tell me the truth, you know, I was having vision. She's like, no no no, please stay away, don't ask, don't you know, don't find out the truth. Or you know what she said, whatever she said, you know, don't go there, don't go down that road. Cause she's scared that this bitch will probably hurt Rael too. Because now Scylla's having feelings. And like she cares about Rael and now like this bitch is like, Ugh, like that. <laughs> don't do that. She's like full choking her and shit. And now oh like the fuck. But she said that she her mission was to get Rael to them, not you know, draw her to the, come to the spree, not to, to Scylla. And obviously Scylla was like, didn't realize that she become, becoming having these feelings for Rael. And now the spree is like, what the fuck are you doing? Like, this is not the plan. So clearly I think Scylla's being threatened by this spree bitch. And maybe Scylla isn't evil after. Maybe she's being forced to do it because her ma, her parents died, remember? So maybe she went, because did this, do you reckon the spree killed her parents? And they took... I don't know. Because she said her parents died, right? Maybe the spree killed the, her parents and took her. I don't know. Okay, see, this is what I wanted. Scylla isn't actually the evil one that I thought she was. Which I had a feeling... Well, we didn't really know much. But, like, that was enough to kind of prove to me that Scylla isn't all bad. Like, there's sh other shit happening. That's like, And she's, like, getting threatened and shit. Like, does she have a choice? Like, I don't know. She do is she forced to do it? Like, who knows? But, like, damn. But, oh, apart from that, that episode is probably one of my favorite episodes this season. Like, this was pretty much the sex episode. I'm surprised. I'm, I'm, if I get demonetized, literally. I must send free form a letter. Joking. Um, but like Tally and Garrett are adorable. I will die for them, please. Anything that um, I love them. <laughs> and like Abigail, she's like, 
her I think her mum's she's really scared of her mum. She's trying to live up to her mum and like it's just that's it's such an interesting I'm j I'm j I kinda feel sorry for Abigail. But you know what I love? I love that the unit the what's a the bellwether unit, what's a unit name again? Um the the friendship has really grown in this episode. Like episode one and two is a bit sketchy between Rayelle and, and Abigail, but now they're kind of gelling as a unit and like Tally's like oh, it's just, they're just they're adorable. I love my unit. Please oh, They're so cute. I love them. Um so yeah, that was my reaction video. What did you guys think? Epa this war, this is changing up the game. All right. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. And um. So yeah, that was my actual one. Do you think? Let me in the comments. I'll see you guys. Um. When am I posting my next one? I don't know soon. Um. Probably on Monday. I don't know. We'll see. Um. Yeah. That's it from me. Ciao for now. Love you guys. And bye.